Amit, also known as Amit or Amemet, is indeed an ancient Egyptian deity. However, she is not considered a god, but rather a female demon or goddess in Egyptian mythology. Amit's name translates to, devourer, or, soul eater, and she played a significant role in the afterlife beliefs of the ancient Egyptians. According to Egyptian mythology, Amit resided in the Hall of Maud, where the judgment of the deceased took place. After a person's heart was weighed against the feather of Maud, symbolizing truth and justice Amit would devour the hearts of those deemed unworthy or impure. She was perceived as a guardian of the scales, ensuring that only those with pure hearts could proceed to the afterlife. So, while Amit holds an important role in Egyptian mythology, she does not represent a sub-judge in the traditional sense but rather a fearsome figure who determines the fate of souls in the afterlife. Well in a roundabout way the person's soul would cease to exist but not exactly as in a, poof, gone sort of way depending on which tradition you go off of. Being judged by Anubis on the scales of justice and having your heart weighed against the feather of truth was a bitch of a task to get through to in the first place. With trials and all sorts of things to ruin your attempt to get into the afterlife. If you were judged unworthy, Amit would devour the heart therefore preventing you from ever achieving entrance into the afterlife and preventing you from obtaining immortality. But it was not the total end whereas you essentially became restless forever. This was called, to die a second time. However some traditions place Amit by a lake of fire where the heart was tossed in and destroyed, giving that total final end. So it's more of which traditions were correct or painted a better picture I guess. Amit eating the heart and making an eternally restless spirit, or a heart being destroyed where Amit watches. Ancient Egyptian religion, is odd with its confusing stories but Amit generally has the two with her, of either the heart eater or watcher of the lake of fire where hearts are destroyed.